Hi guys, it's me Yogi Programmer and today we will cover the topic of agents in LangChain. Why we have to use agents? Let's see a practical scenario. So uh, let's say you want to search something on the Google uh, which is happening right now and uh, your chat GPT or any LLM uh, doesn't know about that, right? So uh, as we all know that uh, GPT is uh, restricted or limited to September 2021 knowledge. Uh, so we have to uh, search on Google. If we have to search on Google, then what to do? This particular use case is what is being uh, addressed in the agents with the use of uh, Google API and I want to search for uh, what is the LLM just released by Meta. So Meta just released uh, Llama 2 and this is the LLM which is uh, you can see it is uh, released on 19 July something like that. Right. so 2023 and obviously your chat GPT doesn't know about that and I have asked him like what is the name of LLM which Meta just released and it is saying as of my last knowledge in September 21 I am not aware of whatever you are asking right uh, so what we can do now is use LangChain to uh, address this issue right uh, in the documentation I am getting this SERP API wrapper so what you have to do is just go for SERP API sign up and you will get a okay, sign up and you will get a API key uh, which you can use uh, here in the SERP API right so I have to copy this first I'm just creating a model here LLM it's simple I guess and then I am creating an object for my wrapper then I can just do any search just three lines of code and you are integrating or connecting your LLM with the uh, real world knowledge of uh, today's world, right? Okay, Obama's first name. I'm not interested in that thing. I want to know the same question which I asked from my this OpenAI Chat GPT website. Let's see what I get. And before that, I want you to know you have to do this thing first I will come to this syntax later but let's see so you have to create a variable self API key in the environment and you have to put your key in that variable okay. so let's execute that okay. so we are getting llama 2 but if we just ask our LLM uh, let me do that LLM dot predict and I'll ask this same thing. Uh, I'll ask this same thing to my simple LLM, my chat model. And let's see. As an AI, I don't have real time information. But if you are using SERP API or Google Search API, right, you can ask these type of questions. Now there is one more syntax which can be overall used for the alt tools uh, in our uh, lang chain and this is the syntax. So first you have to import lang chain uh, agents from lang chain agents you have to import load tools then uh, initialize agent then agent type and uh, this is uh, overall a use case where you can specify many tools like uh, if I can Wikipedia so 
that's also my choice and LLM math and there are many tools by the way you can check that out in the uh, tools section here yeah tools and you can just uh, check out many tools they are giving us right and if I just Here you can see all the calls which you can use right okay so the same uh, question now I will uh, include the verbose uh, is equal true so that I can see how this LLM is reacting let's enter so I need to find out the name of LLM that meta just released so action is the search and the search is being happened on the Google Right, Google search engine action input so this uh, string is being uh, searched on the internet and then observation uh, so whatever the result is uh, generating through that search it is observing that and thought I now know the name so final answer is obviously the name and the name of LLM recently released by Meta is Llama2 I hope you get the idea and you can use many tools here just write for uh, LangChain agent tools and you will get many tools here which you can use uh, in the uh, tool section I am searching for something where they are specifying a list of tools but I don't know why I am not getting that but you can always uh, search for that I think they are doing some uh, changing in the documentation but uh, there are many tools uh, I can guarantee you that uh, like Wikipedia like YouTube API and uh, all other things you can check that out on the uh, documentation okay so that's it for this video and i'll meet you in the next one thanks for watching